Hello everyone and welcome to another Coburg Senior High School Quick Tech Tip. This week I'm going to be showing you the ins and outs of formatting external media. Specifically I'm going to show you how to partition a hard drive um, because it's a very useful thing to do but not only that how to partition it using two different formats. So I'm going to go ahead and go to my applications folder. I'm going to click on utilities and within utilities we want disk utilities so I'm going to launch that. Now, it's really easy to partition a drive into multiple formats. So, as you can see here, I'm going to be reformatting this 4 gigabyte fl jet flash. So I'm going to select the top level of the disk, not the one below it, and I'm going to go into partition. Now it's here that we can view our current partition scheme. It's in MS-DOS FAT32. What I want to do this to this is actually create two partitions. So I'm going to create two partitions. I'm going to have them equal, but if you wanted more space on one or the other, we could drag this slider. So I'm going to select untitled one, and I'm going to drag that so it has about 2.3 gigabytes of space. I want this to be um, Mac OS X extended journaled because um, I want to use it as my time machine backup, hypothetically speaking. And I'm going to select Untitled 2, and from here I'll choose MS-DOS FAT. So this means I can put my movies on it, and I can plug it into my PS3 or into a Windows computer, and I'm good to go. So, with that done, simply click Apply, and click Partition. So it's going to erase all the data on it, and it's going to create a thumb drive with two partitions, one for Mac, one for PC. So this is how simple it is to do using Disk Utility. We just wait a few moments and there we go. I've got Untitled 1 and in a second, once it's done the Windows side, we'll get Untitled 2. There we go. So as you can see here, we've got our two partitions on the one thumb drive um, and you're good to go. So. I hope that was helpful for you. You can do this on any size hard drive and it's a really great and easy way to format um, in the whatever. Hmm.